guys and welcome to episode, believe it or not, 30. Episode 30. We've made it to episode 30. What do you know? <laughs> but in this episode, we will be facing Juventus in the Italian Cup. After that, we will probably, yeah, we'll play this match against Sampdoria and then finish off the episode with a match against Lyonnais. Here we are at Juve Stadium facing Juventus, of course. Will we be able to win or get a result against Juve? Those questions will be answered in the next 90 minutes. Well, let's hope we can possibly get a result. Maybe like a one-all result. A one-all result, that means we'd win, or we'd be winning on a way goal. Not Cielo. Cardona. Cardona! Good save by Rubinho. Yep, Rubinho. We meet again. Oh my god, Pelasi, finish that! Oh my god, Rubinho, please! There we go. Oh my god, there's room. There's Bazoar. Bazoar, please! God damn it! And so it is halftime. <clears throat> my throat is so bad. Right now, it's nil-nil. We've had so many chances. <clears throat> mm. Sorry. Against Juve. As you can see, four shots, four on target. Juve has only had one shot. And, uh, yeah. Let's hope we can get something in the second half. Oh my god, Nipikoku. Oh my god, please. Be the goal. It is! 1-0 to Carpi FC at Juve Stadium. What a counterattack. And Emba Koku finishes it like a king. And there we go, guys. We are 1-0 up against Juve right now. We've absolutely dominated Juve in this game. Cardona. He can make it too. Nope. Rubinho's a god. Okay, we're going to make some substitutions here. I'm going to take off Emba Koku. Put in Lasagna. Put in Brandon Barker for Balassi. And yeah, that'll be it. Go. Lasagna. Parker. Who's there? It's Lasagna! It's 2 0! Kevin Lasagna yet again! Two away goals for us. What do you know? And there we go, guys. A 2 0 victory at Juve Stadium. This could be something. Because, you know, we do face them next month as well. And if we beat them at their home, that could possibly be the match that basically says our fate. Now, I'll bet the match will probably be Rubinho. Because, well, okay, maybe not. Rubinho, though, he had six saves. Six insane saves, let me say that. But our man of the match is Bazoer. He had one assist. And Bazoer... The more I play with him, the more he gets better. And it's it's quite nice, I won't lie. <laughs> here we are, at the Stadion Europa here. We're facing Sampdoria, and yet again, we have a weaker team. But, I still think we can beat Sampdoria. And even a draw, that would be good enough to stay league leaders at the moment. Or at least I believe it is. And actually, no, it isn't. Bereka, Bereka. Honestly thought my 66 rated left back was about to score a screamer. How close was that from going in? It was like whiskers off the post. Good save, Donnarumma. Good save, Donnarumma. Another save. We haven't had a single shot. Sampdoria's defense has been really good for some reason. No, not straight to him, please. Thank you. Alright, so at halftime, Sampdoria probably have had the only three shots of the entire game. I'll check. Oh yeah, we had one shot. It was pretty close to coming in, but no. Uh, any substitutions here? Ta's looking a 
bit tired. We should put in Matry. Might be a risk, but we have to do what we have to do, right? Oh my god. Don't know how they didn't score that, but I'm not going to complain there. Costa. <gasps> what the? What? Rafael Costa, the Youth Academy graduate, has just done that. No way did that just happen. Rafael Costa, you absolute legend of a graduate. What a goal from Rafael Costa. He finally broke the deadlock. Just get him. Get him. God damn. There you go, Leo. There you go, Leo. There's Daniel Marty! 2 0! Daniel Marty, what a goal! And there we go, we have finished off this game. Oh my god, what a save. No! Hit the post! No! Okay, it's only 2-1. It's fine. Just don't concede again. And there we go, another win for us. 2-1 to Carpi FC. Amarty and Raffaele Costa with the goals. Raffaele Costa with that beauty of a shot. Look at our man of the match. It is Daniel Amarty. He had a goal, and that's it. Training sessions for Kamano, Thalander, and Cardona. Now, I'm thinking of actually replacing the lander with someone like Rugani because I want to get some Italian talent in you know it, it would kind of feel more natural as a career mode so we should probably think about swapping the lander for Rugani I mean you guys can decide for yourselves now I have this match against Olympic Lyon in the Europa League at the Stade Gerland can we win here today I don't know we did beat Juventus but uh, Juve didn't do so well at all. Like, honestly, they just didn't. Lacazette, don't give him any space. Like I said, don't give him any space. Because things like that can happen. And we don't want that. Come on out. There we go. Oh my god. Cardona! Good save, Donnarumma. Honestly, thought that was going in. Are you f***ing kidding me? F and they've scored. Maybe, maybe there'll be another comeback? That's yellow. He's found some bizarre! Are you fucking kidding me? And halftime, it could have been one all, but no. Hit the post. Had to hit the post, hadn't it? Cardona. He find Kamano in the middle here. And he finds Balassi. Yes, he can. Can he make it? No, he can't. It's a post again. Good save, Donnarumma. Come on. Pakoku. Balassi. Yannick Balassi. No! That went... No! <laughs> what? No, that went over the line. I saw that. That had to go over the line. What the hell, man? We've been robbed. Come on, Cardona. Yes! Finally! It's one all. There we go. We finally get our away goal. This team, man, it is so OP. It's a good way to end the episode. We get a draw at Lyon. So we do get an away goal for the second leg, which is awesome. It really is. Our man of the match goes to Edwin Cardona. He had, of course, that goal. And he also had some amazing passes. 13 out of 13. He was definitely my man of the match as well. And guys, that is the end of episode 30. 
pretty nice results. I mean, two wins, a draw, it's pretty good. We'll look at the table. As you can see, we are still three points ahead of Juve. But guys, in the next episode, we will be facing Sassuolo in the Modena Derby at home, as well as Lyon at home, simulating this match against Bologna. I might play this match against uh, Fiorentina. Wait, what's next? Juve. Huh. I'll think about the Fiorentina match, because if we simulate that, then we'll face Juve. Because I don't really want to face Juve 3. Yeah, I'm going to simulate the match against Fiorentina and hope for the best. I'll just do that. But anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this series. Show your support. Let's get 15 likes on this video. Let's make it happen. Anyways, guys, if you have any suggestions for things I can improve on this series, be sure to leave them down below. As well as if you have any suggestions for players I can buy next season, be sure to leave that down below as well. Anyways, guys, if you like the video, be sure to like it. And if you feel like it, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys later. Love peace!